Squirt, squirt, up on that scene. Hop out, engine looking clean. All right, what's up, guys? Poison here. I'm back from another video. Today, we're doing a first impression on a new Cyclone Pods um, flavor. Today, we're taking a look at raspberry. So, same spiel as always, where we're just going to give you a quick description of what Cyclone Pods is. Cyclone Pods is a company that makes e juice. Um, jewel compatible pods. Everything they make is zero nicotine though. So they have these normal jewel compatible pods that should be the same size as a jewel. They have extra large pods which hold more juice. They have nicotine free e juice that they make. And then they also have their own device that they um, make. Kind of like an ego type device, something a little bit bigger where you can fill it with your own juice if you want. If you want to buy their uh, device and you know put nicotine juice in it, you can. But mainly, uh, Cyclone Pods is mainly um, nicotine free. So why they put it on the packaging too. Nicotine free on both sides. Yeah, this whole company just makes a lot of nicotine free things. Their whole um, goal is to get people to make sure that they're not hooked on nicotine. Um, and like I said, today, you know, we're taking a first impression at their um, raspberry flavor. Here is a jewel, you know, normal jewel, nothing special. Um, here's what the pods look like when you pop them out. Come in a little blister pack, what I assume a normal jewel comes in. You get a four pack i bought these when they were on sale so i think i only paid seven dollars for these uh, for this four pack usually it's like eleven dollars not bad pricing at all so let's pop one out see what it smells like because i noticed that um every flavor so far strawberry and blueberry have smelled fine oh that smells really strong and good so got the little red part you just take that off i don't know why they come with this i guess it's like to protect it but i just honestly throw these out as soon as i open up a new pod so put it in we're gonna have the light pop up there we go it in the video it didn't look right that that was um that that was a correct color oh it is okay so let's see if we turn off the lights any better eh, more natural light all right so yep green light we're good to go um let's just go for it let's just see first impression clean palette let's see what this is like That was super muted. Okay, there we go. We're starting to get a little bit more flavor. We also got to be careful. Make sure we don't hit this too hard or too long or too much. Because then, you know, um, one thing I've discovered and another viewer have said and commenter that if you vape this too hard, too long, you take too many hits, you start to get, you start to burn out the coils, which is true. For some reason, every Cyclone pod I've tried so far, the coils burn out super fast. Like you could, not that they burn out completely, but you will get a lot of burnt slash dry hits. I guess the coil doesn't wick fast enough for the juice or something. I have no idea. I'm not a scientist. I'm not the one who created this. I don't know what is going on, but yeah, you gotta be kind of liberal i guess is that the right word conservative you need to be more conservative for your hits liberal would mean you're constantly hitting you gotta be more conservative you gotta take less and less hits so you know normally when i do a first impression it's kind of good um the strawberry first impression was good and strawberry flavor was amazing why is there an ant on my laptop what the hell that was super noticeable super fucking weird okay sorry um yeah, strawberry was a good flavor. Blueberry, I didn't like too much. Um, you know, blueberry, I had high hopes for. Even in the first impression, I was kind of like, oh, this might not be good. Blueberry, I, it wasn't good in my opinion. This one, this one seems like it might not be a good one too. The flavor is just extremely muted. I'm not, I'm not a big fan of this one either. So far, out of the three pods I've tried, so strawberry, blueberry, and raspberry, I would have to put strawberry, raspberry, and then blueberry. Blueberry was just honestly the worst one in my opinion, but this is just super meh as well. A little bit more vapor I'm noticing, though. Yeah. It has a little bit more vapor, but... That flavor, man, that flavor is not there. I mean, if you're vaping on this and you're vaping zero nicotine, you're either doing one of two things. You either want flavor or you want clouds. I like both, and you can have both, but this is just not doing it flavor-wise. This is just super meh. I don't know what you could do to make it better, but this is just... It's 
it's there but it's just it's not strong enough maybe i'd like a little bit more flavoring once again like i said with the blueberry though that could just be this pod maybe the next pod i vape on will be better once again i like to vape on two pods then i do the final review so this pod should last me a week also this video is coming out monday it's being recorded on sunday but i don't want to upload it today um on saturday i upload a very important video of something very major in my life and I don't want to have any other videos out this weekend. I just want that video to be by itself. And then, you know, Monday will be back to normal videos. But, yeah, this, you know, I feel by the end of the week I will have the final review out. But this, so far, first impression-wise, it's not doing it for me. It's just, meh. See, now that one was burnt. That, I, I hit it a little too hard and a little too long. That's a little, that was, that was a super meh hit. Not really a fan of this one, you know. It's definitely better than Blueberry, but this isn't. It kind of has like a gum taste to it, like a like a fruity gum, like very subtle hints of it, though. I don't know. Maybe the Jewel isn't made for zero nicotine uh, uses, you know. Um, if you guys don't know, Jewel po Jewels itself are um are meant to be used with uh, nic salt, like nicotine salt, and that's, you know, nicotine salt is a stronger form of nicotine, I guess, I don't know, I remember seeing a video on it like a year or two ago, I don't remember much of it now, but yeah, nicotine salt is supposed to be a cleaner, better, effective way of getting nicotine into your system, and obviously, if you guys vape nicotine, you can't vape certain, like, you can't vape it in certain ways, or stuff like um you can't take super long hits of nicotine because then you get over nicked or whatever so you know jewel was made for nicotine vapors and you know so far zero nicotine vapes just aren't doing it you know i'm saying the flavor is there this is definitely better than blueberry but this isn't amazing by any means i'm sorry cyclone pods you have one amazing one you have strawberry but when it comes to blueberry and raspberry i'm sorry you guys are just missing it See, that was a good hit. That was a good flavorful hit, but yeah, I, I'd probably have to skip on this one too. Um, but I'm saying, I'm hoping it's just this pod. I hopefully when I come back with the full review, the next pod is better, but I really don't know. As of right now, I'm not having high hopes for raspberry either. I think the next one we're going to take a look at is coffee. Let's uh, go to our list up here. Yeah, the next one we're going to take a look at is coffee. So next week that'll happen maybe. I don't know, depending on how much I vape this. Um... These pods do last a good while. Um, my blueberry one last time lasted me four days. And that was four days on constant vaping too. So, But yeah, for uh, raspberry, I don't know, man. This is just cyclone pods. Add a little bit more flavoring. That's what I got to recommend. That's just the best way you can fix it. Add a little bit more flavoring to some of these pods, you know. Um, they work fine, you know. The pods they don't seem to change at all from like which flavor i'm doing it's just i feel strawberry had more flavor in it everything else has been super meh you know this smells good you know the whole pod smells good which is funny because you could actually smell the flavoring and it smells nice and fruity but you just don't get the same effect when you actually vape it so as of right now first impressions for raspberry it, it's a no it's a no for me at the moment but like i said who knows maybe when i start getting down to the actual um second pod maybe it'll be better but as of right now i, I gotta give this one a pass guys but i'll see you guys in a few days i'll see you later today with more videos but i'll see you guys in a few days when we do the final review on the um raspberry one i'm gonna wait till i get to my second pod and then i'm gonna halfway get through it then i'm gonna just do the final review so yeah guys until then have an awesome day thanks so much for watching bye